sunshines. We are great. And we're also extraordinary and excellent in Jesus the Messiah. Take heed that no man deceive you. Read Matthew chapter 24, Luke chapter 21, and Mark chapter 13. Jesus gives us signs. The day of the Lord is at hand. Behold, the day of the Lord cometh. They shall be in pain as a woman. First Thessalonians chapter 5 verses 1 through 4 it is written but of the times and the seasons brethren ye have no need that I write unto you for yourselves know perfectly that the day of the Lord so cometh as a thief in the night for when they shall say peace and safety then sudden destruction cometh upon them as travail upon a woman with child, and they shall not escape. But ye, brethren, are not in darkness, that that day should overtake you as a thief. I read this next scripture before on our channel, Isaiah chapter 13 verses 6 through 13 it is written how ye for the day of the Lord is at hand it shall come as a destruction from the Almighty therefore shall all hands be faint and every man's heart shall melt and they shall be afraid Pains and sorrows shall take hold of them. They shall be in pain as a woman that travaileth. They shall be amazed one at another. Their faces shall be as flames. Behold, the day of the Lord cometh, cruel both with wrath and fierce anger to lay the land desolate and he shall destroy the sinners thereof out of it for the stars of heaven and the constellations thereof shall not give their light the sun shall be darkened in his going forth and the moon shall not cause her light to shine and I will punish the world for their evil and the wicked for their iniquity and I will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease and will lay low the haughtiness of the terrible I will make a man more precious than fine gold even a man than the golden wedge of Ophir therefore I will shake the heavens and the earth shall remove out of her place in the wrath of the Lord of hosts and in the day of his fierce anger. I love the word of God because it is truth. Troubled times we are living in in 2024. Turn ye back to God. Give your whole heart to Jesus. Jesus gave his life for you and I. Don't you wait another day because eternal life is why Jesus perished on the cross so we can have eternal life. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized every one of you in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sins and ye shall receive the gift 
of the Holy Ghost. Your soul is precious to the Lord. Jesus is King. King of Kings. Lord of Lords. And the Father in Heaven, He cares for our soul and where we spend eternity. That's why He sent Jesus. Let's be watchful at all times and be sober and wait for the day of the Lord so that way we are not left here on this earth with the Antichrist who will rise and deceive many. Don't be the one that be deceived by him. You have a blessed day.